Hi, this is uh, where, where we left off, uh, posting sound slides to Tumblr. Uh, we got this embed code by going to the, uh, the sound slides tool uh, called soundslides.com embed, tools.soundslides.com embed. And uh, we're going to go back there and we're going to grab this code here. We're going to just, it, when you click on it, it automatically turns blue. I'm going to right click and hit copy, or I can come up to edit and copy this way. I need just need to copy that to paste into someplace on it on a Tumblr blog. Now Tumblr's just like Twitter except it's a little more souped up. You can follow people, you can share other people's postings. It's a really cool. It's sort of in between a really serious blog that just sits there and it's only you talking compared to Twitter which only allows 140 characters. Tumblr's a wonderful project. Um, but we're not going to get too deeply into this. We're just going to show you what you're what you're going to do is you're going to want to sign up for a new a new Tumblr account and it's very easy. All they want is a password and an email address and and what you want to call your account I would like you to call your tumblr your team name number your team number so it will be oh you know oh one oh two oh three whatever your team number is so it'll be that'll be in the right hand window when you're log you're creating an account I'm gonna go ahead and type in I have one which is my 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 Carl Good and uh, so I'm gonna just do this on my own account and you'll see that, uh, I'll go ahead and say remember that. This is basically um, very much like your newsfeed in Twitter. It's basically these are people I'm following and these are their postings. Um, and then if I want to see what I actually have on mine, I have to click on this carlgoodtumblr.com site and it'll actually show, uh, show what I have there. And you can see that I have a bullfight in Madrid there already. I was testing this. I have some uh, photos from study abroad, blah, blah, blah. So but that's not the dashboard. I'm going to come back up here to the word dashboard and the dashboard allows you to uh, to do stuff, to post stuff and there are all these wonderfully simple looking tools up here that I'm going to go ahead and and uh, I'm only going to use the, they're pretty obvious, but I'm going to use the text one. It's a little deceptive because you, you're thinking why would I post a video or a sound slides project to text? Well, that's where your HTML window is and it's uh, very much like Google Earth. You don't want to post this into a text field. You want to text post it into the HTML field. And I want you to do this exactly the way I'm going to do this. I need your team names, everybody from the group, all of that kind of stuff. And uh, so let's get started. I'm going to click for a new post on a text file here, on the text tool. And here I have all of this good stuff, just an empty, empty space at a text post. I'm going to come down and grab. First thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come down here and I'm going to grab, let's say I'm I'm uh, this team here. I'm going to just grab the, my team name, um, edit copy or right click copy, go ahead and grab the copy of that. And I'm going to go ahead and post that into right into this um, right into this area here. And I'm going to title this the name of my my sound slice presentation, which will be bullfight. Bullfight in Madrid. And so here I have titled my uh, my sound size project here, and I've also pasted in the team name number I mean, as well as the team members, the group members, all of them. So unless you've been fired, you won't have to be here. So I'm going to go ahead and now the thing is, I if I were to just post this HTML now, if I go back, I forgot to I I, I copied the uh, I'm going to copy that again because I copied the team name which which deleted what I had on the clipboard for this. If I pop, pop, copy that sound slides information down there, all I'm going to get on my post is all of that ugly text. There will be no sound slides video because I just posted it into a text field. And I'm going to go ahead and, and delete that uh, because that's not what I want. What I, whoop, wrong key. what I want is this little button right here on the very right called HTML. Please make sure you use this for your embed code for sound slides. It cannot go under here. You'll you'll know right away when you test this whether you did it correctly because it'll show a bunch of code there instead of a, instead of your sound slides. Then you'll have to do it again and do it this way. I'm going to go to HTML, click on that button, and a new window opens up. Now, don't delete this text because this is actually it's actually reading um, formatting your 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 names. But I'm going to leave that there, and I'm going to put underneath your names. I'm going to hit a couple of clicks down, and I'm going to hit Command V or Edit Paste, and I'm pasting in that embed code. And now I'm going to say Update, and then I'm going to say Create Post. 
Now, you don't see anything here now because all you're going to see is the names and that little gray box. That little gray box is good because that means that it's symbolizing that you've got some embed code there. If this weren't there, you'd have all of that code, all of that code piled under here, and that's bad. But if you want to test this and see what it looks like, let's just go click on up here, the tumblr.com account right under there, and we should have a video. Now, you're going to see this is too big. And the reason this is too big is because the default for sound slides is, uh, is larger than the default for Tumblr. And you can come up here to customize this button, customize. Click on that, and, um, and uh, it'll take you to uh, a bunch of themes here. You can click on this theme button up here. And the first themes you'll see are all these expensive ones. But if you browse on more themes, you'll find some in there that are wider, and it'll look a lot better. Uh, I'm not going to require you to do that right now uh, because it's uh, it's good enough to have it like this because when we play this, we can watch it. It's a little ugly. Hi, last summer we, hi, went, last to summer we went to the bullfight. We're not going to get about that. Now, what I want you to do this, when you're done, when it's posted, if you click on this link down here where it says posted one minute ago at the bottom of your sound slides, it isolates that, that post, and I can copy and click this copy that, copy this URL address. All I did was click at the bottom and then I'm going to go to Photo Narrative, our, our website for posting work. You have to be logged in as Student Journ 203. Make sure you're logged in so that you get one of these windows. And this is how I want you to format it. I want you to once again post, paste that Tumblr log, uh, link there. Go back to your, um, go back to your your group name and and uh, and grab the group and post that on top of your of your Tumblr account like this. And the last thing I want you to do, and this will all be spelled out on the thing on the uh, on the on this on this blog in the in the Twitter tutorial, I mean in the um, Soundsides tutorial, is the name of of your bullfight in Madrid. You can make that uppercase or lowercase, I don't care. And then when you say post comment, there it is up there. And I'm going to go ahead and click on this, and this will take us right to your sound slides test. OK, that's it.